From the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good Monday evening, Center County. I'm student meteorologist Christopher Tate joining you on what may be our last 50 degree day here in Center County for some time. It's a cloudy day in Center County this afternoon with just some high clouds passing over the area and it does feel a little bit cooler if you step outside the winds out of the south southwest at 13 miles an hour. Now I know our feels like temperature is still 50 but on my way over to the studio this afternoon it definitely felt a few degrees colder. Temperatures across the rest of central Pennsylvania right now are generally in the low and mid 50s. We got a couple mid 50s showing up. Altoona, you're at 56, Indiana at 55. Harrisburg is the warm spot in Pennsylvania this afternoon as no one has managed to crack the 60 degree mark. In fact, Philadelphia, typically our warm spot this afternoon, they're only at 58 degrees as of the three o'clock hour. The radar and satellite loop over central Pennsylvania and much of the Commonwealth actually showing us just those few scattered clouds passing over that I was talking about. They're of no impact to any of us and a couple light rain showers passing out through northeastern Pennsylvania on their way out of the state. They're going to be leaving us alone as we head through the rest of the day. Now eventually that's going to change as we take a look at this short range computer model showing us a little bit of rain moving in out of the west to start the day on Tuesday. We may see a little bit of that here in State College. It won't be heavy and it won't accumulate much, but you will want to have a light rain jacket as you head out the door Tuesday morning just in case we do get a little spritz here in Center County. That rain's going to quickly march its way out of the region and we're going to be left with what should be a fairly pleasant Tuesday across the Commonwealth as far as November Tuesdays go with the temperatures dropping and well clouds starting to build in for the entire winter it always seems. Now here's the big story. We're starting things off Wednesday at 7 a.m. Now this is one computer model solution for a winter event that could be heading our way over the next couple of days. Temperatures are going to start off Wednesday morning right around the 30 degree mark here in Center County, generally in the upper 20s and low to mid 30s across most of the rest of the Commonwealth. Clouds are going to start to build in early Thursday morning and yes, ladies and gents, that is snow and mixed precipitation starting to build in out of the north that may be impacting us as we head through the day Thursday into Friday. What we're going to be watching is just how much of this is actually snow and just how cold State College is as we head through the day on Thursday. The closer we are to freezing 32 degrees, the more snow we'll be able to accumulate at the surface. Right now it's not looking like it's going to be too big of an event, but it is something that we're going to have to watch very closely. Eventually the precipitation is going to move out by late Friday morning into early Friday afternoon. Now here's another computer model solution once again starting off in the upper 20s and around the 30 degree mark as we step through the day on Wednesday. Pretty much the same story. Clouds are eventually going to build in late Wednesday night into Thursday. This computer model a little bit more bold with where the rain is going to be. And as we head through the day, notice it had a well-defined line that is going to start to break up a little bit. As State College is expected to be really close to freezing, we may see a little bit more snow according to this particular computer model. Stay with us over the next couple of days and we'll see which model ends up being a little bit more accurate and has the better guidance for you. Once again, just as with the first computer model I showed you, precipitation is going to start to move out early Friday morning and we should be left with a fairly pleasant, although cold, Friday afternoon. Behind that cold front, temperatures are going to be fairly chilly for this time of year. Friday morning, only 23 degrees to start the day here in State College, only warming into the mid 30s. Harrisburg not even breaking 40 as we head through the day on Friday. And then Saturday morning, 21 degrees in Center County. Some of the outlying areas and some of the higher elevations may even start the day in the mid and even upper teens. As we head through the day on Saturday, temperatures are going to warm up into the mid 30s and maybe even to around the 40 degree mark before eventually falling back down into the 20s. For tonight, though, not near as cold. 41 degrees will be your low, mostly cloudy skies, winds out of the south around 5 to 10 miles an hour. And as we head into the day tomorrow, we are going to have clouds building in. Chance of light rain, as I mentioned, so do make sure you have the rain jacket with you. Winds are going to be out of the west around 5 to 10 miles an hour. And we may even see a little bit of a gust nudging up to around 20 miles an hour. And then as we look at the rest of your seven day forecast from the Campus Weather Service, it's basically our last gasp of fall, at least for the time being. Thursday, we are watching to see exactly how the day unfolds. And then you notice temperatures Friday and Saturday cooling back down into the 30s for your highs and low 20s for the lows. 
Sunday we eventually get a little bit of warmth back with clouds building in and then Monday is supposed to be a cold and dreary day. Notice that's a high temperature. That's a high temperature folks of only 28 degrees to start next work week. Hopefully it'll be a few degrees warmer than that. From the Penn State Campus Weather Service, I'm student meteorologist Christopher Tate. Have a great evening.